Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of our Stardew Valley playthrough. Today is the Feast of the Winter Star, so we'll need to bring a leak for George. We'll also bring a jade for Linus to finish his quest. Before the festival starts, let's quickly do our daily routine. Our ancient fruits are finally ready, and they will be ready for harvest every week from now on. After we deposit our stuff into the chests, we'll turn these ancient fruits into seeds. Alright, so we have got our leek and jade, we are ready to go. We'll first head up to the mountains and give Linus his jade. Alright, it's now time for the festival. There's really not much we can do at this festival, so let's just take a quick look around and give George his gift. Alright, that was pretty much it for the festival, so let's head back to our farm. Let's finish up the day by planting some ancient fruit seeds.
Alright, today's Friday, so we'll check out the traveling merchant. And the goal for today is give out rest of our gifts and to Clint for his birthday. We'll bring an emerald for Clint and an albacore for Gus. Before we give our items, let's do our daily routine. Let's drop off four items and try to find Alex near the spa.
Barney has a quest for us, so we'll pass by our farm and give her a pike. While we're here, we can check the traveling merchant. The last person we need to gift this week is Sandy in the desert, so we'll bring her a flower and mine in the skull cavern for the rest of the day. Alright, before we go to bed, we'll deposit our stuff and process some more things. This is pretty much the end of the day and the episode. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one.